Hi guys! Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> Actually, he's as big as me, so I don't know if I can say he if I if I can say that. But he seems to be upset because he he's turned the, his back on you and he don't want to turn it on. I finally got the Horde Fanatic, Fanatic um, pet from PvP. I got my Prestige to level... I mean to Prestige level 1. And I'm really proud of myself. <laughs> I did maybe 15 arenas yesterday and I lost all of them. Then I leveled up and my friend needed one more so we went i saw druid and pharaoh and frost mage and i was like we're dead it's okay we know that we really suck in arenas and we have no chance of winning so fuck it let's go try and kick some asses like every single arena before that <coughs> and we won i was incredibly surprised that we won we and now we both have our heart fanatics and the amazing thing is which i don't know if came with patch 7.2 or with me reaching uh, level 47 and unlocking this last trait the the requirements got to 550 and stayed that way till i leveled up i'm not sure if blizzard decreases the requirement or it's just like after this level i will never know unless somebody in the comments below tell me but I got lucky, I got happy and I got my bed and now I'm going to level him because well he has some nice some decent dragon fighting skills which I'm going to use because now you cannot see because my UI is bugged. Oh no you can um is per battle increase experience and I'll go level him up pretty pretty quick quick and you will see him in action maybe maybe not probably not but who cares he's here to look pretty and cheer for the hordes i don't know when he does it i saw once that he stole something from my hair and blah 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 if you look him up in warhead you will find out what i'm talking about and the footage you see at the moment is from the new dungeon. I realized I wasn't kept, I wasn't filming after I killed the first boss. So that footage is after the first boss. And today, if I'm lucky enough, I will go in Nighthold and finish my bosses because we managed to kill few and then we wiped and everybody left is always nothing new in wow it always happened like this we spent as i said a lot of time as i said in my previous video spent a lot of time hour and half or two hours i'm not quite sure looking for new members we got some but because it wasn't quick enough they start living and stuff and stuff and now I'll have to look for a new one. From what, what I read in Wallhead and in forums and stuff, normal is now like LFR. Just you get people from global, which is kind of stupid. Okay, not global, but like they don't queue. And you get teleported, you need to teleport yourself actually there. And you don't get cooldown you don't get loot anymore but you don't get a cooldown so you can do it as many times as you want on normal 
is you can get as much bonus roll as you want on normal which was kind of strange but I'm okay with that which means I'm not locked and I can go and try with other raid if that's right if it's not then I guess I'll spend a lot of time waiting for people to queue and then I'm going to be really disappointed when I don't see them when I enter in the raid but that's that will be just um, that will be just a formality so I made a video for about why they don't make a friend chat in WoW like having all your friend list have a chat like type slash F maybe and speak to all of your friends from your friend list only in WoW not in other games so when you need a healer or a tank, you can say I need healer for there and you don't have to ask every single player um, if they have healer, if they are available, if they can come or their item level and stuff. You can just say I need healer with that item level and whom, whoever wants to, he can come. But they probably will not make it, I mean they will probably not design it as some people said they're pretty lazy some others said it will not be so cool if you have 200 friends which i don't see well okay maybe if you have 200 friends and they all talk at the same time but you still can separate it or something i don't know anyway i have experienced this and i did not have 200 friends i had around 50 or something but it was amazing and it was like a group chat sometimes you can chat and if you don't want to read it you just can you can just ignore it so. and when you date up your name it is um, in different colors so you can see if it's for you if it's not um, they even made it if you if they tap your name it got you alert something like this I don't remember it was really long time ago and now i just don't have anyone to talk to in this friend list because all of my f actual friends people with whom i was i'm speaking they're like hey i haven't seen you for a few years how are you and this you remember even my my in-game name it's because i have forgot it forgot it and i was like i don't remember how to log in i don't remember my, even my username and they remind me what it is yeah that's an actual online friend not the one that ask for favors and if you don't log two months they delete you but that doesn't matter um as i was coming home i saw a tweet from blizzard which says that buffy the vampire slayer has um 20 years universe anniversary today and it was pretty funny for me because yesterday i finished re-watching the first season of buffy and i am planning on starting the second one today because it's boring doing raids and stuff i mean lfr it's I don't know I need something to keep my mind awake because otherwise I get really really bored and start yawning or whatever it's called and got sleepy and start making mistakes and when something is playing on background it's much better for me I can focus <laughs> better I know it sounds funny but it's fact okay um, another thing I got I got the um, chocolate celebration cake recipe and it, it was really confusing for me it took me quite some time to get the recipe products and stuff and I made it and it looks like this and I really don't like how it looks but lucky for me it's not as tasteless as it looks 
bad. It looks really, really bad. I don't know why it's it it's looking like this. I know it's not green and and stuff, but I just had only brown chocolate. I couldn't find white cooking chocolate and all those colorful things. I probably could find in some other bigger supermarket, but I just don't have those around and I had to spend maybe two hours because the city is big. I had to spend two hours just going there and buying it and then coming home and making it more four hours because that's an insane recipe. And it's not that bad when you taste it. I don't understand a thing um, an ingredient from this recipe port teaspoon of port please if somebody knows what a port means I'll be really really thankful because I search in YouTube I mean not YouTube I search in Google I, I made my friend search because sometimes I search something and I could not find it it just don't show up for me and they do find it but they didn't find it as well I, I look dictionaries I asked my Google assistant and nobody knew so I didn't put it maybe that's part of why it came up like this but I guess I have to force myself to eat it and the worst part is I have to force my friends to eat it and that's really mean because it's not that tasty but when I think about it the brownie I didn't like it at all I was ready to throw it away and they ate it and they made me make even more so let's hope they like it and they'll eat it and I'll not have to eat it because I really don't like it it's edible but I don't like it I would not make myself eat it unless I have to and I do have to because it's so many ingredients and the most one the the most expensive one is um, I had to I bought a chocolate for around 5 euro which cost more than the, the cake the other ingredients cost like 5 euro and I bought two chocolates for 5 euro it's uh, anyway I had to and I ho was hoping it would be nice, but it's not. And, uh, anyway. Um, so, yeah, uh, the chocolate cakes say um, it will make you very happy for one hour. And I would say yes. I was very happy before I saw what this thing turned out to be. Or before I... Yeah, I was more unhappy when I saw what turned out to be than when I tasted it and I got a little bit more happy maybe that's the point when you try it when you look at it it looks so bad so when you try it you will really get happy for one hour happy with yourself it's not that bad they have good point <coughs> I cannot wait to try the mammoth uh, if there is such a recipe the smelly mammoth or something it was that makes you angry that maybe it will look really good and it will turn out to be really really bad and to make me really 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 angry yes I can cross that out of my bucket list and this one as well and I guess that's all I think I'm out of subjects for this video I spoke a lot oh I forgot to say something I am working um extra hours because we have much work and we cannot get ready in time so we will be working late and i will have even more time to play wow and make videos so i guess you not see any special and extra videos of mine anytime soon so basically that's for me from me that's it from me yeah that sounds about right thank you so much for watching guys and hope to see you again for the next video, probably at Monday. Bye-bye.